All right, so I know that we have a lot of background noise going on. We are in Daro right now, San Jose Street. This is San Jose Street, right across from where all the tricycle drivers play volleyball and also where the new hospital is going up. And I was driving by here today and I saw this Chinese restaurant. And I wasn't aware that it's here. So me and Lynn are down here. It's uh, Monday night. We're gonna be having lunch here. We're having dinner, sorry. And uh, I'll tell you how it is. Come along. All right, so here we are. Quen Hua is open 10.30 to 10.30, I guess. Oh, 8.30. And they are open. And it's air conditioned. They have a Samsung inverter up on the wall. And it's beautiful. It's a small establishment, not too big. Very clean. And it's authentic Chinese. This is real. Chinese. This isn't the kind of Chinese you get in America, the Kung Pao chicken and stuff. This is the real stuff. And we're going to be checking out some of the offerings here today. It's a nice place. I like it. I'm all kind of nervous, but we'll get it done. Okay, now there used to be another Chinese restaurant, Dumaguete, called Power Up. And uh, they also used iPads for the menu. They didn't have a printed menu, it was all on iPad. And since it's a Chinese restaurant, there's a lot of stuff to go through. And uh, they got special orders, rice meals, noodles, light meals. I might go for some noodles today. Some soup, rice meals, Chinese style. All the prices are low. Egg tomato rice, 140 pesos. Sauteed chicken with fresh vegetables, 180 pesos. Chinese style chicken, a frittata. 199 pesos, Chinese style sauteed pork, 160 pesos. I might be getting that, I don't know. But we're definitely gonna be checking this out. But it's funny how the two Chinese restaurants that were in Dumaguete use iPads. <laughs> I don't think Lynn's very excited about this because I don't think there's enough rice for her. We ordered the family tofu sauteed chicken and some steamed dumplings and uh, they give you some sort of pickled stuff. I'm not quite sure what this is. I'm gonna try it out. Toothpicks, of course. They have toothpicks. Chopsticks made of metal. Uh, so that's kind of stinky. And tea. I'll try the tea now. All right. Here we go. Ah, oh, the tofu. They got the burners going because you need super high heat for really good quality Chinese food. They got the hood for the range right here. And of the corner, they're doing other stuff. Crap. So Lynn's accusing me of talking too much. Being overly loquacious, as it were. So now I'm not going to talk to her. I'm going to go Tom Paul. Philippines. So I talk too much. Yes, you do. I'm sorry. You always do. <laughs> All right. So the first meal that came out is the family tofu. This is like 140 pesos. It's cheap. Tofu is good for you. It's got a bunch of vegetables in there too. And that's what he was cooking up when we were just back there. So we'll be digging into this. Mm. Tofu. Tofu. Good texture, not slimy. It's got a bit of heat in there. I like it, I like it. It's good. Mm -hmm. And since this is Chinese food, it comes out really fast because the wok's super hot. And there's the chicken with vegetables. Mmm. So that's one thanks. It's good. Not too hot. Mm. She gets the chicken, I get the tofu. Yeah. We're still waiting on our dumplings, which will be coming soon, I'm sure. They're mixing the dumplings now. Okay, so just a little note on the portion size. You can see this is a really good portion right here of the chicken and vegetables. There's a lot of chicken in there. And it comes with a side of rice, and I think that's 160 pesos. And again, the tofu, it's uh, plates a little bigger than my hand, and it's full of tofu. And I asked them to make it a little spicy, and it's got some good heat to it. It's really nice. Thank you. And that's why we have the service water. 
And finally, our dumplings have arrived. All the food arrived within 10 minutes. We're cooking up fast back there. So we have three plates of food here. We're gonna be kicking through. And the dumplings, of course, come with some dipping stuff. And these are steamed, because it steams healthier than fried. And tastes better, in my opinion. Go with dumpling. Mm. Really good. Okay, so we just finished up, and uh, yeah, if you're ever in the need for Chinese food in Dumaguete City, there's a new Chinese restaurant here. It's, right now, it's the actual only real Chinese restaurant in Dumaguete because Power Up closed down, and the other one, Chin Lun, isn't really a Chinese restaurant. It's right here on San Jose Street in Dara. Check it out. Uh, low cost Chinese food. Two thumbs up. I like it. This is Ned. That's Lynn. We're my Philippine dreams. We'll see you next time.